the experience and not frantically going back and saying like, oh, I'm not sure what that preference was and, and now I've got this. Um, also, be sure that you have those step in the ER numbers. It'll be on the little card, so really the only thing you'll need to do is just take that card and put it in your wallet. Um, contact your bank, research your host country, and adjust your frame of mind for adventure. So I think that that about covers it. Sorry, I took up probably more time than needed. But if you do have any questions, um, feel free to shout them out now, or you can follow up with me through email, or stop by the study abroad office. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So let's say I had a run-in with the law. Okay. <laughs> and you some pasta or something, I don't know. And, okay. You know, I'm in a high-speed foot pursuit, action pack, running on route, and that's what I'm Once I make it to the consulate, I'm safe, right? I can't do anything. Yes, but you know, it is sometimes the position of our government to extradite criminals for certain offenses, but I don't think stolen costs would be one of them. So, um, yeah, but, um, but you know, that is something that in the event of emergency, you could go to the consulate, and it is the role of our government to protect our citizens. So, good to know. Good, good question. Oh, okay. Good question. Boy, we can have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> Any other questions, concerns at this point? Because if that's your only concern, I feel okay, I think. <laughs> so. All right. Great. Okay. Thank you, Marcia.